Welcome, friends, to a new episode of Imperion. We are hanging out today inside of the Riot Craft base. And last episode, we did a bunch of constructing and things like that. So let's take a look. Uh, oh, yes, I changed my key bindings. It's E. So um, we made an assault rifle and things like that and um, did some upgrades and got some levels and things like that, and I've been making some blocks and whatnot. So one thing I tried to record and totally missed out on was um, there was an iron deposit over that way past Baz's house. Well, I went to go try to get that, and I was, I was at least I thought I was recording all of this footage, and um, I got completely hammered and just wrecked by there was like three raptors and a spider that killed me and then I died and died and died and died over and over and over again and I lost all of my stuff so I had to I had to rebuild it all and I thought I was doing all of that on camera but I wasn't I actually I didn't I didn't get any of it <laughs> so I'm sorry you guys missed out on a little bit of that it was pretty much me dying a whole bunch and then redoing all of this because I lost everything I lost all of it I couldn't get it back and then it all despawned so that's okay so I got back to normal I started gathering up the nice thing is I didn't lose a bunch of these materials because they were in my my constructor here but I have made a bunch of stuff so I got my rifle back I have made a large constructor a coal chamber a fuel tank a water generator and a small generator. Now, you're probably wondering, what are those things for, Clobberstab? Well, I'll tell you what they're for. And first, we gotta take a little adventure. So let's check it out. And I'll show you. If we go walking over this way, you can kinda see right over there. Come on. What? <laughs> right there? Look at that base, BA. This is my base, my base area. Super cool. So let's get over here and take a look. Um, I have been, do I not have enough jetpack? Okay, there we go. Um, so yeah, I um, have started coring out this mountain here with the drill tool and been kind of just going to town making a huge base and I figured what we would do today is actually make our base um, I'm not gonna do all of the work here because what I found is building is quite uh, tedious quite tedious by a long shot so let's get, put you there there we go and okay perfect so we're gonna do three blocks out um, and I'm going to have this platform kind of go out a ways to maybe, I don't know where. I haven't decided yet, but we're going to, I'm going to build that. But look at, so I, I put this all in here and I cord it all out. And it, we're going to do a lot of work on this as we kind of, as the season progresses. But we got our, our uh, faction here. We got to put our core down. And I figured I'd just get that going off camera. Really not too big of a deal. As you can see, I kind of moved some of this stuff back. You guys can see what's going on. And that's kind of what I've been doing. I've been placing blocks and coring out, placing blocks, coring out, and doing that sort of thing. So I think what we will do now is let's open up our stuff. And we're going to put all this stuff back. And we're going to get our large constructor, our clone chamber, and all of these things going. And I don't think we need our multi-tool right now. So, what should we place first? I think we should probably place our constructor. And the reason we want to place our constructor is... And you know what? I'm going to have to redo all of this. This is only temporary. So, we're just going to place this down. As you can see, I, you know, there's a lot of work I got to do. But it, building's really tedious. So, I didn't want to do a whole bunch of building on camera. But I did want to get these things down so you guys could kind of see them working. Now let's get our small, 
Ooh, does that work right there? It does, and it goes out. So I placed the generator, and now we need to place a fuel tank. So we will place the fuel tank. Actually, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna place this down here. So let's get our tool, our multi-tool out. Five, and we're gonna get rid of this guy here. There we go, and place this guy here, boom. So now we've got our fuel tank. Let's press E on that boy, bad boy, and let's fill that with that. And the reason we wanna get all this stuff down is because, ooh, that doesn't work. Oh, this has to be a water thing, it has to be down in the water, doesn't it? Okay, so I think what we're gonna do, let's do this. I've changed my key bindings a little bit. I didn't like how F did, was using stuff, so I changed that to E. We're gonna place you there. Um, and then my run is control. That helps out a little bit. So I need to get some energy, which is okay. And I think what we're gonna do is get our water. Um, what is it called? Our O2 generator? Water generator? What is it called? Let's get this thing. I forget. I'm drawing a blank right now. Our oxygen generator. Left control plus E. Pick it up. There we go. E. Come here. There we go. And we've got all of our stuff out of it. So that's going to despawn. And then we're going to move this over to near our base. Oh, I'm stuck on rocks. Here we go. Oh man, it was treacherous trying to get, I was trying to get more iron because I need to make bullets like you guys saw in the last episode. And I just got completely hammered by those other, by all those raptors. It was just not cool. So let's get our oxygen generator and we'll place this kinda um, I want to kind of put this all together. Um, okay, we don't want to do it that way. And we don't want to do it that way. That's what we're looking for. Perfect. So now those are kind of the same. So what I learned is when you're trying to place something, like let's say placing this guy, as you... You guys can see there's a clone chamber. Now, if I press delete, it'll show, you see the little blue line? It's really tough to see. Let me see if I can get closer to it. There's a, if you press the delete key, see there's that red line that comes up and then the blue line. Now, if I press the home button, that's the access it will shift on. So if you can change your access by pressing the delete key, and then you can rotate it whichever way you like, and then you can kind of try to get it like see you could place this sideways like that's kind of a cool way to place the clone chamber right so you can kind of get some different designs by doing that sort of thing so let's go place this guy up here um, that way when we die or if we die again we will actually go up to our base I also changed my key binding for up and down like down was C if you're flying and I change that to shift, um, similar to, to Minecraft. So um, I'm pretty sure we need to, there we go. And I wanna rotate it. Yeah, there we go. We'll place you like that. There we go. Now we've got a clone chamber. Now I think if we press Y, we can turn on a whole base. Yep. Y turns on everything. You can see all the green dots. Woohoo! Sweet! So the cool thing about this guy is the large constructor gives us access to many more things like Pentaxid and like here's some other things. Advanced CPU, flux coil, power coil, and gold coins, at least in that one. Um, this gives us access to many more things to start building a ship and things like that. We can get the food processor. We can get bigger fuel tanks. 
um, different Cockpex RCS. This is things that we're going to be making soon when we make our small vessel in the next episode. I think that's what we're going to do. I have been playing around with a lot of this stuff. The other thing we want to make is some sort of sentry gun or a cannon turret. 20 metal components, 5 electronics, 2 motors, and cables. So this thing actually, I want to get all of my stuff moved over to here and see if we can maybe make a sentry gun and put that guy like right here so we're a little bit protected. So let me gather all my stuff and I will bring you guys right back. All right, guys, we are back and I was able to get uh, some of our stuff moved over, which is all good. And let's make a cannon turret. Look at, you can have a, whoa. Oh, so if you, <laughs> If you may, if you do a shift click on this guy, it's going to make all these things that it needs for it, which is super amazing. And it just goes through and look at how much faster it goes. Like the other one, it took like a really long time to chug through all this stuff. The large constructor, really nice. So this uses 30 millimeter bullets. So we're going to have to make a bunch of those too. How much are these? Five magnesium powder, five metal pieces. Let's make 50, I guess. Okay. And then we'll make the sentry gun as well. Oh, we don't want to make 10 of them. I guess we'll make two. And then we'll make a whole bunch of five millimeter bullets too. Five, 10, and then shift click makes it go up by 10. Let's see. So it should make everything we need. All right. Did it make our cannon turret? Look at that, it's gonna make it. Boom. Super cool. So this goes a lot faster than it did before. And I think we also need to make this guy and this guy. This does take a little bit, it looks like. There it is. So let's take that guy. We will place him here. And let's take this guy and place him. That is a lot bigger than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> oh, man. I'm kind of not prepared for this amount of firepower. But you know what? We'll place it right there. And press E. What? <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> Super awesome. Ah, uh, nice. Um, what else can we make here? I think we need to make some sort of ammo box. Um, let's see here. I thought there was an ammo box. Door blocks, core, fridge. Oh, we definitely need to make one of those. T1, tier one fridge. Oh, I don't know that we've unlocked the ammo boxes. I think we're gonna have to unlock them. Oh, look at this other stuff. So there's an antenna, radi radar, console blocks, artificial indoor plants. Oh, decorations, pretty cool. So yeah, we've unlocked some other stuff, which is super great. Um, that's the clone chamber. So yeah, we need to keep unlocking things in the, the tech tree, but we will continue as we do it. I just haven't got any uh, up updates yet. So, well, all right, guys. Um, I think that's going to cover. Do we finish all our bullets? Um, let's take those. I think I need to get an ammo box before I. Yeah, I need to get an ammo box. Otherwise, it doesn't work. OK, well, let's see if we can get that going. A fridge. I don't think I have it unlocked yet. So. Well, that's something I will work towards. We will work on getting a refrigerator. That's going to be... Whoa, I don't need 10 of them. We'll work on two. <laughs> right? Actually, I don't even think we need two. I should just get rid of one. We'll just do one for now. And that's going through and making tons of bullets, which is great. We'll have a sentry gun. Well, let's... Can you go away? What are you? What does it take to make you? Five metal pieces. There. <coughs> there. 
Oh, you can't make it go away. Shoot. Well, how do you... Maybe you guys know how to do that. How do you get rid of something in the first part of the construction queue? So now I kind of don't want to make that many. But, okay. Well, all right, guys. You know, we're learning. You know, if you guys have tips and tricks, let me know. I'm going to have to push some of this mountain back because that looks ridiculous. And this thing is a lot bigger than I thought it was going to be. I didn't realize it was going to be a 2 by 2 block. But... I'm sure it said it in the stats and I'm just not paying attention, but check it out. We have got a little bit of a base going. Pretty cool, hey? So, yeah, I'm gonna core out more of the mountain. We're gonna make this look a little lot, a lot prettier. And um, I think we will catch you guys in the next episode. As always, guys, don't forget to like and share on your favorite social media and stick around to the end of the video. You will see some links to other uh, series that I do. If you guys like them, go ahead and uh, check those out. There's a lot of cool stuff there, Lineage and FIFA and uh, city skylines, things like that. So I think you guys will really like them. As always, guys, I will catch you guys in the next episode.